Hey, Passion Projects. This is Eric Ingram back with something. No, just to talk to you guys about a little something. Um, I've witnessed many people around the world going places, um, doing new things. Um. Exploring what I haven't explored or haven't been. Um, I I am trying to launch a stage play doing what I think is my calling. Trying to do YouTube. Trying to grow big. And I know it's like... Everything is happening bad. Everything is going so slow. But what we, what I have to, what we, what we have to learn to do is wait on the blessings to flow. And what I mean by that is wait on what Jesus has for you. Not, you know, trying to rush things or go upon things and try to do what you know you think you're supposed to be doing and you know rushing going over things and you know doing things that not what's your calling and what Jesus said for for you um, it's all about being consistent and staying positive and waiting on your blessings um I've been waiting. I've been contacting God. I suddenly, I, I recently, not suddenly, I recently um, got in, got close with one celebrity. And now I'm knocked off the map from her. Um, at the time, she, she, she invited me to her birthday bash. And I was telling her the reason why I couldn't come um, and that July, the beginning of July, um, my cousin was shot down. And um, while he was getting his autopsy, body was out of town. It took like through two, uh, it took like a minute before he could come back, um, before they could send his body back to um, our hometown, but, um, the reason that I couldn't come because of that funeral that they had, and the reason I was telling her because I didn't want her to be, you know, why didn't he come, and what the reason was why he didn't come, and the reason why is because of that, so I text her, and I was telling her about it, and a day later, I was blocked. I was blocked because I was trying to tell the truth. And, you know, I'm not going to put in the details. I'm not going to tell y'all who he is. I'm not going to, you know, do none of that. I'm just going to, you know, say that was a problem. Now, I see different people... Being in movies, Tyler Perry movies, different movies. And I'm like, why can't I be in different movies? I'm just as talented as they are, as they, as they. And everybody tells me I'm funny. Everybody tells me I should be in movies. Everybody, I write my own plays. I write my own movies because of one person and I'm not going to put that out but I love who I am I'm going to step who I am I'm going to keep waiting on you know and I'm going to be you know cons consistent with YouTube you guys I don't care if I have two views I'm going to still upload I don't care if I have one I'm still uploading on YouTube because I feel that if I wait, my blessings is going to flow. I have different 
people people judge other people but you got to you got to learn that when you the only one that can judge you is God. Nobody else can judge you. Only one can judge you is God. And I don't care. I don't care who you worship. I don't care what you worship. I just want you to believe in who I believe in. And that's Jesus Christ. That's the only one. Because the only thing you have to do is pray, believe, and your problems and worries will go away and everything will succeed in life. It's the only thing you got to do. Don't matter if you broke down lights, anything, car messed up, you're staying on the street, anything, you're homeless. Just believe in yourself and everything will succeed. I was, I was, I'm just, I'm just thinking right now, like, should I stay writing plays and thinking about fulfilling my dreams and going forth in my dream. And some days I want to give up, but I still, I still believe that it's coming to pass. Every time I look at the person that inspired me to do this, movies and plays and books and everything that person do it's inspired me to do better and keep doing what I do in life and if people don't like me for who I am then I don't care God love me for who I am and that's it that's all you got to worry about is him up above but I just, you know, come up here on YouTube to share something with y'all to, you know, let y'all know what was going on today. I know I didn't um, upload the other, I uploaded Monday. What day is Thursday? I uploaded Monday. Didn't upload Tuesday and Wednesday. So I'm uploading today. And I just want to let y'all know that I love you guys. Excuse me. That I love you guys. And I will be back with more videos. Just bear with me. I'm doing the best that I can to make my dreams come true. Make it come to reality. I, I would love to be in movies, anything. I just love being a part of what I do. And I I recently did an um, audition in my hometown. Um, her name is, I'm not going to you know, put out nobody's name. I can't do that. So this, per, this lady came to Albany. Albany, Georgia, this is where I stay in. And we did auditions for um auditions for the talent. And I did an acting scene of what I did in a play when I um on I think it was in April. <laughs> April play. So um I did this the script that I read, I did in April and it was like everybody loved me and it was the first time I experienced someone that you know came up to me and asked me for pictures to take pictures asked me to you know that they, they, they love my audition and it was like overwhelming because this little boy came up to me and wanted to take a picture and his mother was saying that he was watching my audition over and over. And that's what I like to inspire people, to help people go through many obstacles, to give them give them plenty of encouragement, give them life, give them and give them inspiration and 
what I've learned and what I heard is all you have to do is have faith, faith of a mustard seed. And it will grow. It will grow to become bigger and bigger in life. I love you guys. Talk to you soon. Hey, this is Eric Ingram. I just want to tell you guys I love you. Keep pressing. Keep encouraging. And keep being a subscriber and a protege of Passion Proteges. Yes.